Professor Phil Rocock's comments, regardless of their satirical intent, are both inappropriate and alarming. In today's deeply divided climate, especially around issues of voting and political dissent, making light of violence only serves to deepen rifts and provoke unrest. You guys are smarter than girls. You got some serious problems. Uh, it's what frustrates me. There are going to be some males in our society that will refuse to vote for a potential fe female president because they don't think females are smart enough to be president. We could line all those guys up and shoot them. They clearly don't understand the way the world works. Did I say that? I, scratch that from the recording. I don't want the dean hearing that I said that. <laughs> the statement about lining up and shooting. Men who don't vote for female presidents isn't merely a failed joke. It promotes an unsettling narrative of authoritarianism and bigotry. This incident highlights a troubling trend within academic environments, where irresponsible or extreme speech is often met with indifference or tacit acceptance. 